because of long time traditions and uh, chess was uh, uh, chess was part of uh, intellectual life in uh, uh, in uh, Russian Empire and so uh, big writers uh, great writers they were playing chess and so this was uh, a privilege and part of uh, a top society uh, uh, top top society people uh, and then uh, after revolution uh, new power uh, they they saw in chess the tool of uh, bringing uh, 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 knowledge and education uh, because uh, it's it was easy it was cheap and uh, if we recall the time when the revolution has happened so uh, most of uh, educated people and top top level top society people they left the country and so new power should uh, should work out something to uh, to make new uh, new intelligence and new intellectual people and so they believe that uh, with the help of chess they could do it and especially it's very cheap compared to any other things uh, i don't talk even about sport but about other um, uh, subjects uh, and sciences and that's why it was supported uh, and even during civil war when we had civil war in 1920 uh, first uh, championship of uh, soviet russia took place uh, and later later it, it became part of uh, education system uh, before the world war ii uh, and uh, after all, uh, chess became a national game, like uh, you have here in America, you have baseball, and so Russia had uh, chess.